What is going on YouTube fam? It is your boy Dylan Flex. I hope everyone is having a great weekend. Today is actually Saturday. Saturday is a crazy day today guys and especially for shoes. We had the shadows drop, we had the Yeezy blushes drop, we had the undefeated drop, we had a bunch of shoes so today was really sick. I wanted to share with you guys my opinions, wanted to know what your guys' thoughts were too. Without further ado, we're gonna jump into it but first, let's roll the intro. So first and foremost, jumping in to none other than the shadow ones right here, guys. So my first impression of this, I obviously like the gray and the black, the colorway. I think it's sick. A lot of people were trying to compare this to shattered backboard quality. I had a lot of people like, no, Dylan, you don't understand. The shattered backboard quality and this are very similar. It is not the same as the shattered backboard quality and you guys know yourself too when you have the shoe. Not knocking the shoe, I definitely think this shoe is great. I did pick one up to obviously complete the set, so you know, I had to do it like that. And let me know if you guys had a hard time actually copping the shoe. I know there was a lot in Vegas, but they did sell out everywhere. And let me know if you guys did cop. I definitely have to say, if you're a Jordan 1 fan, it is definitely a must. The shoe is sick. But let's jump into something a little crazier in my opinion right now. I'm a huge Ultra Boost fan, so this right here just kind of blows it out of the water for me. The white undefeated Ultra Boost. So the white one is actually more limited than the black. I'm a huge Ultra Boost fan. See, I started with Ultra Boost, so Ultra Boost is like, to me, by far the most comfortable shoe. Not that Yeezys aren't comfortable. I wear Yeezys all the time but Ultra Boosts are super, super comfortable. This undefeated colorway is crazy. Definitely a must cop for me. These are actually skyrocketing up. I see prices anywhere from like 400 to 500 bucks on this. These are super crazy. We did end up getting a couple in store and we did sell them online. I posted them on Capital Vegas. Definitely have to say that if you're an Ultra Boost fan, the undefeateds are a must cop. Not to mention, had to do it in black. See, I like it in black. I think the black is super cool. The white's so hard to keep clean, but in my opinion, the white is probably the best one. Not only because it's limited, it's just super clean. The black one though, man, this is a crazy, crazy shoe. For my Ultra Boost people out there, let me know if you guys copped one of these. Man, this shoe is the shoe. I need a white, I need a black. Back it up, let's get it. Had to get both of these. We do have a couple sizes in here. So make sure you guys check out the website. Pictures and sizes are on there. Today was one of those crazy days because normally just the Jordans or a Yeezy or something releases, but no, it was multiple, multiple shoes and they all were six shoes. So it was really hard to actually pick which one to get. So we had a bunch of people come into the shop and we bought shadows, we bought Yeezys. I'll show you guys the Yeezys in one second, but we are not just a consignment shop, guys. I know a lot of other people are. We actually do buyouts, so if you guys have undefeateds, we're not really taking any more shadows at the moment, but if you guys have undefeateds in white and black, you have Yeezy blushes, hit me guys, write us on Capital Vegas, DM us prices and sizes. We're not taking in any more shadows, but we are buying. I'm gonna tell you guys what I think about the Yeezys right now. Man, look who just pulled up, the mayor of Las Vegas, Mr. Shit. Jail himself, what's good fam? No, just chilling man, kicking it. Okay, something light today. I actually forgot to tell the people. See, I was hyping about the Yeezys. What do you think about the 500s? 500s are cool. Yeah. You know, this is, so no personal pair for you, right? Of this? I have a personal pair. Man, the light's not picking up. Jail got everything, man. Okay, so today is now Sunday. I actually didn't get to finish the vlog from yesterday when I was talking about the shoes. And I also forgot the Vapor Max that also released, which was super sick. If you guys got your hands on the Vapor Max, I actually like the white one more than the black one. Super sick. I got too busy yesterday, unfortunately, so I couldn't film the rest of the stuff that I had to film. But I wanted to show you guys and get your opinion, and I'll tell you guys mine, on the Yeezy 500 blushes. I do have to say these do look pretty sick to me. At first glance when I saw them, no, my camera's not picking up. Come on, camera. At first glance, 
I thought it kind of looked like a hiking shoe. I was like, oh, Yeezy, what are we going hiking again? But I do have to say, I do like this shoe. I did not pick up a personal size because the shoe that we did have in store, which was a size 11, it sold out. So I couldn't get my pair. Let me know what you guys think of this. This weekend was super crazy when it came to releases. I showed you guys before, obviously the undefeateds, the Vapor Maxes. Oh, I have the black one here now. The white one sold before I can even do a review on it and we don't have any more in here, but I am taking consignment and I am buying. So please contact us guys. We're filling the store up slowly but surely. Yeezys, Jordan 1s, slowly but surely, guys, doing it the right way. So I hope everyone is having a relaxing and peaceful Sunday. I wanted to get this video out before the Golden Knights play tonight at 7.30. Being born and raised in Vegas, guys, I got a rep. It's crazy sick, we are in the playoffs. So a big shout out to Golden Knights, baby. Go Knights, go. And let me know what you guys think. What did you cop from this release this weekend? And if you have not already, like, comment, subscribe. Join the Flex Squad. Man, I just wanna go flex. Hold on my teeth and on my neck.